with this week's fish video. I've got some neat things to show you this week, including some homemade caves I made for my African cichlid tank. But first, I'm happy to announce I finally bit the bullet and replaced my AquaClear 110. I had to get a new one since back when I added sand into my aquarium for the first time, I destroyed the last one because I didn't turn it off and it actually sucked a bunch of sand up into the propeller and it destroyed it. So I bought a new one and so far I love it. It's probably the best hang on back filter for um, any medium sized tank that I've ever really had and provides great surface agitation so you're getting lots of oxygen in the water. A great filter and I would totally recommend it to anyone who's looking for um, anything over 100 gallons. Uh, in terms of the fish, they're doing really well, growing quickly. Uh, most of them are over the three inch mark now. Definitely starting to see some color and uh, dominant behavior coming out, which is why I had to add the caves. But for now, the tank's at peace. <laughs> Let's just uh, hope it stays that way for a while. So the caves I made are actually out of rocks that I salvaged out of Lake Erie. I just scrub them really well before using aquarium silicone to stick them together and I left a small opening for the door so the fish they just love it they sometimes fight over which fish has which cave but overall I just think it adds a necessary complexity that you really need to have when you have African cichlids especially if you're having fish that are different sizes um so yeah that's about all that's going on in the tank I've changed the aquascape quite a bit as you guys have probably noticed nothing too drastic hopefully I can leave it this way for a while as you guys have seen I've definitely been trial and error with this tank but it's one of my favorite tanks I definitely enjoy it quite a lot I hope you guys do too so let me know what you guys think post a comment or a question below uh, don't forget to subscribe for more future videos I try to post at least one a week so stay tuned for that and thank you so much for watching.